Tonight, protesters back on the streets and in front of the U.S. Supreme Court after last week's bombshell leak of the Supreme Court draft opinion from California. Abortion is health care and it's 2022. I can't believe we're having this conversation, but here we are. Demonstrators showing the abortion debate is far from over. Keep abortion safe and legal. And in the D.C. area, dozens protesting outside the homes of conservative justice Brett Kavanaugh and Chief Justice John Roberts. In a statement last week, the court saying the draft opinion, which suggests the conservative majority on the court plans to overturn the landmark 1973 Roe v. Wade ruling, quote, does not represent a decision by the court or the final position of any member on the issues in the case. But House Speaker Nancy Pelosi today saying the draft is still a slap in the face. Here we are on Mother's Day, a week where the court has slapped women in the face in terms of disrespect yeah. for their uh, judgment about the size and timing of their families. So the fact is, let's keep our eye on the ball. The ball is in the court of those justices. And there are renewed calls for Congress to take action. The Women's Health Protection Act, which would codify federal abortion protections, passed the House back in September, but has stalled in the U.S. Senate. My Democratic friends are trying to pass a, a law Wednesday that will allow abortion right up to the day before the baby is delivered. Different states will take different approaches, so the abortion debate will not go away in the country. It will be decided by the people, not a handful of judges. Senator Amy Klobuchar telling ABC News that if Wednesday's scheduled vote fails, Democrats are ready to take the issue directly to voters. We march straight to the ballot box, and the women of this country and the men who stand with them will vote like they've never voted before. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.